Alright guys, I'm going to show you here quick. Uh, with, with my global company placeable dryer setup that I made, or I should say edited, you're going to, when you have global company open, and it's going to be looking different than what we got here. This is the original one. And when you buy it and place it down, you'll get a wet corn holding bun. Stand up dryer here that we got and an LP tank. When you guys do that, you need to have a couple augers around. And I did this kind of the easy way I could for myself. I wanted to have the experience of using the augers so. If I click my button in the big red square right here, your auger needs to be in that for the trigger. And that's going to be the input. And then uh, where the output of horn is, is actually right here at the end of the dryer. And once again, show you the trigger. I know it's going to be the triggers of the auger in there too, but it's going to be this little yellow square here. So the best thing I did was I extended it out. Oh, wrong button. Sorry, guys. I extended it out and made it so it comes out under this pipe. If you put an auger, a little auger that you got down and load it in the truck, you're good to go. This is only going to take corn, maize, as of right now. You will need to change the fill types and output types according to your map. I made this one to work on Flint Hills as of right now. Which, therefore, you use maize, normal in-game maize, and you put that in and it'll dry it to dry corn. Now, also with this, when you hit Control g and open up for your factories, once you buy it, you'll have this menu. You're going to open the menu and it will be turned off. You can see I got corn in that says wet corn here, and I got LP. Now you can buy LP in this menu, and once you buy LP and put corn in, it puts uh, dry corn out. This is how many liters the wet corn old bin puts. This is uh, how many liters of LP you can hold. And this is your output. And I made it slightly lower. I might lower that even more yet. And then you're going to click start once you have all that. And I'll show you quick. I know we only got 1% in there. But when you're here with the unload, and I set this whole setup up so it'll just be like a transfer auger. So we got 436, and now we have 447. It does work, you just need the augers. And if you really wanted to, I do have a trigger here on the LP that you could haul the LP as long as the map has it. Once you have it going, you should see the steam coming out of the dryer. And that all is all it is. Just control G for global company and keep an eye on your input outputs. Make sure you got everything there and you're good to go.